changes in the Pumas team for this game, brought about mainly by the substandard performance against Fiji. If you're trying to distinguish between the Lanza twins on the wings, look at the jersey numbers, because that's the only way their teammates can work it out as well. Solidity is restored to the midfield with the return of the vastly experienced Rafael Madero, while at halfback Martin Shangwala makes his test debut. In the forwards, Argentina have lost their top line-out man, Gustavo Milano. He's replaced by number five, Sergio Carosio. The team captain, as usual, Hugo Porta. The Italians have also made six changes to their side, which lost badly to the All Blacks on opening day. There's plenty of speed out wide. Much will depend on number 10, Oscar Colotto, who moves in from the centre position he played against the All Blacks. Halfback Fulvio Lorijola is a vastly experienced player, and in front of him are a big mobile pack. We're in the lineouts. There's a huge fellow at number 5, Antonio Calella. Expect much more heart and commitment from the Italian pack than we saw at Eden Park. The side is captained by number 7, Mazio Innocenti. Big scrum here for Italy. Lorijola, Anita Fred quickly. On the blind side, flicked it to Innocenti. Italy have their first try of the Rugby World Cup. Listen, I'm glad to see it couldn't have happened to a, a chap who's tried harder, who's really been trying to lift his side, Innocenti. I just mentioned before, body position's good and he dives in. Beautifully worked by Italy. They controlled this, even though they were going backwards to a large extent. Good work by the halfback, Lorijola, flicked it to Innocenti, and the captain of the side scored the try. The reserve halfback. Italians have quickly taken the line out. Running it out towards their left wing three-quarter, Cotita. He's got pace as well, Cotita. Oh, beautiful. Brilliant try. on both wings and this is a brilliant try by the Italians the back spun it very quickly indeed full back to Baldi was in and gave his wing three-quarter Marcello Catita some room to move but he had to break through three or four tackles and what a body swerve and in he went and scored a very good try indeed